Elon Musk's boring company is one step closer to achieving his planned Vegas loop, which would see much of the Las Vegas uh, in the web of tunnels. Welcome back, dear friends. This is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com. If you are here for the first time, please subscribe to our channel because we have boring company news coming as soon as they become available. So Las Vegas is set to expand its transportation network, but this time underground. A company owned by Elon Musk is developing a web of tunnels under the city to speed up the transportation across the area. That company is called the Boring Company. Musk's plan is to populate the tunnels with Tesla all-electric vehicles, meaning commuters will be able to travel miles underground at incredible speeds on Tesla vehicles. The Boring Company, which Elon Musk developed to solve the problem of soul-destroying traffic, that was a quick, that was a quote, solve the problem of soul destroying traffic. <clears throat> that company aims to be um, aims for roads to go 3D. 3D means both flying cars and tunnels are on the table so far. Imagine flying cars. Musk is already in the process of building a shuttle beneath the Las Vegas Convention Center where Tesla vehicles will move visitors between exhibition halls. These shuttles have been given permission to transport up to 16 people at a time with up to 62 vehicles in service simultaneously. Now, note the very important thing here, friend. These shuttles are given permission to transport up to 16 people at a time. And also, a little bit above, I said that Tesla is going to use Tesla vehicles. And no wonder several days ago we reported that after General Motors announced that it, it will uh, have a electric van to preempt Tesla, the next day Tesla also announced its uh, leaked um, its van program, electric van program from Tesla, which we have already covered. If you search electric van torque news, that will probably come. And also, uh, which, was, which was leaked by an official from uh, Ontario International Airport, from Ontario, where they they are where Tesla is going possibly to build the underground tunnel. Okay, so let's move forward from uh, with our with our um, report. This is the first commercial project for the technology titans, Tesla's infrastructure business, which uh, Elon Musk founded in 2016. If you remember in 2016, in 2016, on December 17, only basically four years ago, Elon Musk tweeted the following, traffic is driving me nuts. I'm going to build a tunnel boring machine and just start digging. This week, Two new resorts in Las Vegas have announced plans to join the network of super tunnels, to join the network of Las Vegas um, uh, Boring Company's tunnels, uh, which will um, link them to the existing convention center transit system, which is due to be completed in early 2021. The tunneling projects at the convention center is estimated to cost around $53 million as part of a much longer expansion of the site costing over beyond 900 million dollars over three quarters of the tunnel have already been completed in fact uh, i think a few weeks ago you saw our report that the second uh, tunnel was already digged and now uh, tesla was working actually the boring company is working on the stations above the tunnels there will be two stations on each side and in the middle there will be a middle station to um, move people uh, through the, the Las Vegas Convention Center. Now, where will this tunnel lead to? The success of Elon Musk's initial tunnel in Las Vegas means he is one step closer to achieving his planned Vegas loop, which would see much of Las Vegas accessible by underground electric shuttles through the Boring Company. According to the Boring Company, the express connection will operate at speeds of up to 155 miles per hour, meaning a journey, which usually takes half an hour at peak times, could take just three minutes. It will, the overall, uh, that will start from the Fremont Street experience and go all the way to uh, McCarran International Airport of Las Vegas. The next stage for these tunnels would be linking the Las Vegas project up 
with the existing tunnels in Los Angeles, meaning a normal journey of around four to five hours by car could take under two hours with little to no carbon emission. What about elsewhere? Last week, it was announced that the Boring Company was the front runner to produce a small, uh, similar loop at Ontario Airport, California. The high-speed electric transport tunnel would link the airport with nearby city Rancho Cucamonga as a more cost-effective and greener alternative to, uh, to, to the traditional rail system. Torque News has already reported this and you can check its very interesting information there. Could this same technology be used in Europe too? Yeah, I'm asking in Europe because of like we have uh, the traffic is uh, bad in large European cities and Tesla is already very active in Europe. Tesla has the Gigafactory being built in Berlin and Tesla vehicles will be built there starting with Model Y. So for major cities without an existing underground network, these boring companies tunnels could be a realistic option. For example, as Paris and other major cities consider a future without cars, perhaps underground tunnels for drivers or electronic shuttles are the best way to secure an environmentally conscious future. Global engineering and infrastructure company Iricon is working on a similar project across Oceania with the new tunnel in Melbourne, Australia and Auckland, New Zealand in development. The idea is for these tunnels to transport communities by easing gridlocked traffic at peak hours and reducing pollution across the cities. Elon Musk's futuristic tunnel system is ambitious and innovative. Going underground makes sense and many cities have vast tunnel networks beneath heavily populated areas. For example, the London Underground, so we know it can work. His vision presents an existing alternative to our gridlocked presence, says Iricon tunneling expert Tom Ireland. Many of the world's largest cities have reached their capacity to absorb new infrastructure on the ground. These cities are looking at solutions both above and below the ground to overcome mobility challenges. He concludes, navigating through long established build form can be technology and aesthetically challenging. So creating below the ground transport networks such as underground rail and road tunnels is high on many cities agendas and these projects are currently transforming cities around the world. It remains to be seen whether similar green initiatives will pop up under other major cities. Perhaps in the meantime, we should be making use of these ancient tunnels found in rural carnival. Huh? What do you think? <laughs> uh, friends, let me know what you think about these developments. I think it's very exciting that uh, the things are... <clears throat> tunnels these green tunnels are uh, growing imagine las vegas uh, the boring companies las vegas tunnel will start from fremont street experience go all the way to stratosphere and then uh, circus circus the drew resort world and then uh, will be las vegas convention centers which is the current work there is only small part of it and then is going on uh, keeps going on uh, las vegas boulevard all the way to to the McCarran International Airport. Uh, it will actually go to Terminal 1 and Terminal 3, as well as uh, toward Los Angeles. Uh, what do you think about using the Boring Company to take a trip from Los Angeles to Las Vegas or from Las Vegas to Los Angeles? I'm wondering, will planes fly after this? I mean, if, it, it's, if it's going to take you only two hours uh, to get from Los Angeles to Las Vegas, will you go through the, all the security checkpoints and go to airport and go to the airport traffic i don't know how long uh, where it will go into los angeles but it may if depending on which part of los angeles you are it may be quicker to take the boring company and uh, and then and, and get to las vegas than to get to the airport of los angeles and to fly to las vegas but it depends where you're flying it depends where you're going uh, whether you're making an international trip or you're going uh, just your if, if it's las vegas or las vegas area is your final destination friends let me know what you think about this if you're from europe or australia and in your city there is big traffic do you think something like this like boring company or maybe a local version of it can benefit your city how do you think this benefit do you mind driving underground 
that much and not seeing the sunshine, the light. I don't know. Let us uh, consider this in the discussions uh, below. In the meantime, this is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com. Please subscribe to our channel as we are going to bring you more news about boring company, Tesla and electric cars and green transportation. As well as please like this video and to show your support of our channel, we would greatly appreciate that. And to show your appreciation of all the people who help us to bring these stories to you. I received many good tips from you guys. I really appreciate that. And I look forward to reporting these stories to you. Have a wonderful day. God bless you. Take good care of your families, friends, and uh, keep uh, retaining our humanity in a good shape. Have a wonderful day, and I'll see you in our next report.